Greetings everyone, I'm Eshkova from Blood Moon Pictures, as you can already tell. Um, yeah, it's time again for the vlog for this month. I know I don't look the best today, um, I actually just woke up and it's already 14 o'clock and in four, uh, four and a half hours the vlog has to go online. Um, because I w always want to do it on the exact day I upload it, so it's um, the most... It's, it's, uh, it's just like nothing much has changed when you see the video. But that aside, that's just my personal stuff. Um, this month was a whole lot, like literally. A really lot happened in this month and I'm glad for the half of it. Because good things that happened, or like in my eyes good things, the journey with Markiplier and his uh, his video about um, Blank Dream ended and he did uh, That Dragon Cancer. And those are t two like really big things that are in my life, like important to me, uh, English I not can good, <laughs> but <clears throat> This journey with him was something special, and well, a lot of other things happened. Like, for example, Pokemon Go got launched here, and um, Mimi was to visit here. Evelyn was uh, uh, was visiting me as well, and um, she's moving here next month. And um, I believe there was something with Jack Septica he did. Oh yeah, the music video all the way. Oh, I love it! I love it! That's It's so amazing. It's like, it's just Jack and he believes in us, he believes in Steve and you know that move. You probably, you probably know that. <laughs> anyway, um, what also happened, just like, I read it literally half an hour ago that the child of Matthias in the manor was born and for the for the very low chance that you see this video, Matt, Matthias, Amanda, congratulations. And Luna, I'm so glad that you finally made it into this world. You have two amazing parents. And even with the fire on and all, all of that, it's pretty scary. And we, I, I was really concerned with your vi when your parents showed me the video. I know you don't understand me, you're still a toddler by now, or a baby even. Um, but seriously, met, met, met um, Matthias and Amanda, congratulations from the deepest of my heart. I'm so glad for you three. It's been a journey and it was a cute journey to be honest. It was a fascinating thing to see um, first parents growing up with their child. But enough of that. Um, the vlog is not about other YouTubers, it shouldn't be at least. But I want to address a few bad things that happened as well, but I wanted to get the good things um, first, so the vlog has a positive or a mo more positive imagery. But there happened a few bad things in the world, like the past month. There were actually a lot, especially in Europe. It's, it's just, it was a tough month, and um, for the world, but it was also a lot of happy things happened. Like, I mean, sure, they are just small things, but everyone will say that, and it's getting repetitive by now on the entire internet, enjoy the small things. Bad things always seem bigger, always seem worse than, like, everything that's comparable but the thing is Luna Eleonora the child of Matthias and Amanda is born and I know it's just like for their community is a good thing and all the other people probably don't even really care but it's still a good thing and it's not even their child the past month probably hundreds of child were born and I don't want to like put down Matt and Amanda's birth, like, seriously, uh, congratulations, congratulations for that, but the thing is, just because bad things happen in the world, 
That doesn't mean that we should stop believing in the good things that happen. And there are good things. Like, for me personally in my life, you hear it on the start of the video, the month was 50-50. And I'm sure sad for everything bad that happened, and I sure grieve for every single thing. Like, these things shouldn't happen, humans shouldn't be that stupid. But sadly it is that way, but that shouldn't stop us in being happy, in going our way. Work with it how you have to work with it, but don't let it be a border to keep you away from happy things. And that's basically what I'm doing in life. Even if I'm like something totally small and unimportant actually, like for example, um, I uh, give someone a present and they don't like it. And I'm like, oh, okay. But then they um, say they appreciate the gift. And I'm happy about that they appreciate it. That's easy as it is for me, but I do understand how like bad things can stop you. But don't let that happen. Like, it may be in your way, it may be like a big glooming thing above your head that's trying to push you down, but don't give it that power. Anyway, the other thing is, I promised you to read a few comments, and I will do this right now, when my computer is working, that is. Uh, but the thing is, I don't have really much comments. From Mimi Likes You, it is. Awesome video, smiley face. So funny, even if it scared me once or twice on the Blood Moon compilation. Thank you very much, I really appreciate it, and to be honest, it was a hell of fun to complete, to make that video. Um, next one is... <laughs> Big Smiley Face from The Biggest Fan, she made a lot of comments, i sorry if you are he, but you have a female avatar, avatar. I can't breathe, oh my god, on the YouTube, YouTube Meet Regal. And yes, I had tons of fun, I didn't even plan on making that video. So I was messing around with the gift set and everything and I was like, okay, just have to do this now. <laughs> it was amazing. It was fun as all, everything. Okay. Um, next one is Salty Scrub Lord from on the, the whole gang is here video. Amazing video, buddy! This is with with it without a doubt the best spin-off game ever uh, FNAF game ever made. And I can't wait till they make a full game. N new like and sub and new like and sub for me. That's great. Um, thank you. A really load, salty scrub lord. Really, thank you, thank you, thank you for all of that. I appreciate it very much. And we had a little conversation there. I will blend that in um, now. And then there was. Another comment I wanted to read on the last re on the last vlog bit, it's O O M G. I love your shirt. Thank you. That shirt holds a special place in my heart. But I, but the bad thing is, I seem like I'm like a <laughs> kind of like a beefy guy, and I don't want to come out, come around like that. I just like the shirt because it's kind of special and unique with the brown thing on that. I love your videos a lot. You are so nice and very calm. I don't know about calm, but thank you that you think I'm nice. And now I'm curious about the Moonlight Beasts. I read uh, in some of other um, in some other comments about it. Can you please tell us more sometime soon? Hashtag keep reading your comments. Okay. Well, um, I think I will dedicate a full video on that, um, like in the future, not right now. Um, basically, the Moonlight Beasts are my family. Like, the people I consider my family um, in the newfound era of my life, if you want to say it like that. And, um, like, seriously, these people are like family for me in the deepest sense that ever made sense. Um, but we interact towards each other and within uh, with each other more like uh, Japanese royal family or clan however you slash clan however you want to call it but um, 
It's just because we're not blood related. Like, literally, at the time, no one of us is really blood related. But, um, for example, Evelyn is inside the clan, of course, because she's part of the family. And we consider the boyfriend or girlfriend of any of us to um, be part of our of the Moonlight Beasts. Just because when we feel like family to someone, they're considered part of this family. Which is basically every family ever. And um, the, only thing, uh, the only thing that uh, divides us from like other family boundings and what, whatnot, or fan clans or whatever, is um, we have a few set rules, not nothing major, just like um, don't do anything really stupid. Like for example, don't do drugs. <laughs> I'm serious though, don't do drugs. It's ba they're bad for you. But basically, um, those things are just like uh, in order to keep us together, in order to assure that we have the same mindset. Because um, it's hard, it's a hard time to consider someone your family you totally disagree with their lifestyle with. It, that's just a basic thing and it, it's not like keeping people from not doing it because all of us just agreed we will never do it because why should we? It's more, I mean, it's more the thing of um, making cle a clear statement to others who don't, who don't know us how we are and how our lifestyle is like, but really, it's no like major things. Like we don't like, it's it's not a, a cult or anything by any means. Oh God, no! It's just like more like basic things. Like please don't do drugs or please uh, don't do anything illegal within the German law law or uh, be nice to each other. Basically, like basic community rules or event rules in that case. It's just in order to like have a feeling of how our lifestyle is in order to know by just simply seeing these rules and saying oh okay well I won't uh, bother you or oh okay I like that um, that's a good thing just like basically nonsense <laughs> and um, we make role plays and we work together on creating um, our future life but the most important thing is, and I'll get into deeper detail in another video, don't worry, this is just basically what's uh, from the outside. We are basically there, or like we founded our family, our um, the Moonlight Beasts in general, because we want to make the world a better place. Not with our presence, but in order to help others, in order to help anyone who needs help and who accepts help. We just are there as an instance for everyone who needs us, for everyone who wants our help, for everyone who who would like to have help. And we even like um, already donated, not really much, but a bit, to um, good uh, money to good causes. Like for example, the Humble Bundle, just recently ago, or um, WWF in anonymic order, um, and all these things. Because we want to make the world a better place for the future generations. Like, in the literal meaning in any way. We want to help the environment as good as we can as a group. We want to, um, we want to just try to make the people nice, be nicer to each other. Um, and we're not like an official organization or anything, or well, at least not yet. Um, but Blood Moon Pictures is. And, we'll, and the most of us want to reach that goal in making the world a better place by entertaining you guys. And for every one of my subscribers, I'm really, really thankful, but I'm also happy to see that you guys enjoy our work and, feel, and get enjoyment out of it. But enough of the rambling, I'm probably way into... Oh god, I'm 20 minutes in. Um, I'm really sorry for every subject I did talk about right now, uh, please just Write a comment in the comment section below and ask me. And that being said, I just love all of you guys really, really much. If you haven't subscribed yet, um, consider subscribing if you like our videos. We would really enjoy that and you would just help spread our love, <laughs> so basically uh, our will to entertain people. And give this video a like if you enjoyed it. 
and to the next time, we will see each other in the next video. Cheerio!